Setting up habits and getting your clients to track them inside PT Distinction is very, very simple and it's really, really super simple for your clients to do. You do it from the client dashboard or if you're setting it up for multiple clients at the same time, let's say you wanna do a more automated system, sort of like the Precision Nutrition Pro Coach system, then you do that from a group and that will work in a very, very similar way. So when you're in the client dashboard, you just come down to the schedule and click on add event. Give a date you wish it to start. So I'll do that for today. And a time you want them to track their habits. Chances are you want them to track habits in the evening to let you know whether they've actually done it for that day. And then come up to event type and click on habit from the drop down. Put in your title. Now your title is the habit, so it's the question you want to ask. For example, your habit might be drinking two liters of water a day. So the title could be, did you drink two liters of water today? Put in a question mark and then write, check in if yes. So that gives them a clear instruction of what to do if they did complete their habit for that day. You can choose a different color for your habit. This is the color it shows in your client schedule online and in your schedules for your clients. And you can choose to add it to your own calendar if you wish to. Both of those are up to you. Habits are likely to be repeating events. So you would click on repeating. And let's say you want it every day for three weeks. You just choose every one day for three weeks. You can add any notes you wish to, but it's probably not necessary for habits, and then save. As you scroll down in your client schedule, you'll see that in the evening they have their habits, and it's very clear, did you drink two liters of water today? Check in if yes. Your client would be able to click on it, and they would get the option to check in, or not. So they'll leave it if they haven't, they'll check in if they have. More often than not, your clients would actually do this from inside the apps because it's very, very convenient just to click in the apps and check in or not check in. So I'll show you how to do that now. So here in the app, your client would simply click on their schedule. They would see their habit. So it says, did you drink two liters of water today? If yes, then click on check in. Very, very clear what they have to do. And if they've done it, they just click check in. That's it from the client's point of view. And now I'll quickly show you how it lets you know in the alerts in your dashboard. And when your clients have checked in, you will get an update live time. So it'll come into your alerts and you can click on alerts. You can look at all of your clients who have done certain things. Now this particular client is new client. You click on them and it brings you into their activity page. You'll see that there's two check-ins and you can come down and you'll see percentage. So you'll notice that they've done 10% of their habits because they've checked in for two habits out of the 21 that you've set. So 21 would be every day for three weeks. At the end of the three weeks, you get an overall percentage of the number of times that they completed their habit. As you scroll down a little bit lower, you'll see that they checked in on their habits. You'll see which habit it is because it clearly says right here and you'll see the date of the habit and the time. If you've got lots and lots of stuff in their activity page and you just want to see the habits, you come up to this drop down here, choose check-ins and that opens up another drop down where you can choose to just see their habits. And what that'll do is ensure that only the habits show up so that you can see every single one of their habits over the period of time you're looking to check for.